Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share the latest word given to Terry Hennessy. The title is Fear Not, Part 2, and this word was posted April 17th, 2023. Daughter, I am here. Write these words. No more are the days of shying away. No more are the days of passivity. No more are the days of being quiet. Today is a new day. Today is the day of redemption, salvation. Your sanctification and the process all of my saints have gone through, each and every step of affliction, heartache, tears shed, all was meant to be as it was endured, for it has purified your hearts. It has allowed the sincerity to rise, and all that was bathing in pride to dry up and disappear. My beloved saints, my beloved remnant bride is filled with humility and selfless love. Resembling myself, she longs to also dry up and disappear, that I may be made full within her. And so shall it be. The day is drawing near, my beloved. I know many, so many believe in their hearts that they are prepared for what is coming, because you know that I am with you. But it is extremely important to stay close to me every minute of every day, lest fear grabs hold. I don't want that for any of you, and this is a testament to your true faith as the days grow darker. If fear creeps in, you will see as a testimony, you are not close enough to me. When this happens, close your eyes and meet me in the secret place. Here is where I will meet you. Ask of me to give you my peace, and I shall remove the fear and will hold you close that you will increase in boldness and confidence that I am with you. I am for you. I am. There is no one and nothing on this earth that can harm you or hinder you so long as you remain in me, so long as you cling to my garment, holding on to me like you would, as a small child holding tightly to daddy's hand and feeling so safe because you know if he is for you, nothing can come against you. So be bold, my precious ones. Be courageous in the coming storm. As you begin to see it rolling in, come and sit at my feet and sup with me. I will feed you strength, resilience, perseverance, and bravery, and you will feel at ease. I will fill you with my peace that surpasses all else. I love you, my precious children. Fear not. Fear is not your portion and never will be. Those who fear belong not to me, but rightfully so should they fear. I call these ones to come to me with a surrendered heart, a humble heart, full of repentance and contrition, that I could draw them close and cleanse and wash away the residue that has been sticking to them. It takes a humble and contrite heart, for I resist the proud, but give grace to the humble. I call these ones now. Come to me now, on bended knee. Humble your heart. If you don't know how, ask of me to do it for you, and I will give you the humility you seek. I long for none to well up with fear in the days ahead but that all would have the peace and confidence I offer to them all. Won't you come to your father now? Time is short, my children. Come to me now, that I may cover you and bless you with power, love, and a sound mind. I love you with an everlasting love, and wait for each of you to draw close to me, so that I may draw near to you. I am with you always, my remnant. Be encouraged. Be at peace. For my peace, love, strength, joy, 
and power do I give to those who are mine. Won't you be mine? Love your Papa, Abba Father. And that is the end of this message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you, and I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.